Some of California's national forests are now reopening two days earlier than expected. Weather conditions are helping to control fires that have been plaguing the state. Sade Brown has more. Regional areas are reopening earlier than expected. That was the announcement made Tuesday after the recent closures of the nine national forests temporarily being closed due to the multiple wildfires scorching California. An estimate of 7,465 fires burned over 2.2 million acres across the state. However, the U.S. Forest Service says there are forest-wide closures that will remain in place and will be extended until September 22nd in Southern California area due to fire damage. Danger. But as for the National Forest in Northern California, the Shasta Trinity National Forest will reopen Saturday as the closures will remain in effect until Friday night. And the Monument Fire area closure will remain in place along with other local closure orders. The Forest Service says the reason behind their decision in reopening some of the National Forests are some favorable factors. The forest officials have made this decision was due to the predicted weather conditions that were coming up for the weekend ahead of the rains. Um, I believe there was going to be some gusty and breezy winds with that. And the other reason is we still are in very dry fuel conditions. And uh, with those winds and those fuel conditions, if we do get a new start, it's just off to the races again. So we would like to just, you know, give that little buffer, let everybody know that we are opening on the 18th with exceptions of those fire areas. And as we're leading to reopening the forest, the Forest Service says we are not out of the woodworks just yet. You know, it just just be aware, we're, we're not out of fire season yet. So that is one of the reasons that the fire officials have decided to, you know, keep the forest closed just for one more, two more days, just to be on that safe side.